And a glorious afternoon greets us here today for Box Hill United hosting the Goulburn Valley Suns. The visitors have been a rich vein of form recently, whilst Box Hill United are unbeaten and a new coach, Greg Casidis. So Dusky knocks the ball into the area. Kiruku can't get there. Falls to Berrio. Oh, what a strike! What a save from Petrovsky! The former Melbourne City youth team keeper gets up high and tips it just over the bar. That's fantastic. You see on the replay here. Oh, that's a great save. Boxer going forward now. It's Kaluki in the middle. Oh, great save, Petrovsky. He really should have done better there, the Boxer United striker. You see here on the replay, all the time in the world, he really should have slotted that in the corner. Here come the Suns driving forward. Oh, he could be in trouble here. He could be in trouble. It's a straight red card. Whoa, oh my. The referee's made a big decision there, and Barrero has seen red. Ellis steps up. Oh, just over the bar. Connell, I think, might have had it covered. Corner coming in here for the Suns. Carly hits it. No. Oh, so close from the Suns. Califardis probably could have done better. Ball comes into the area. Ellis can test. Mikasa! Oh, 1-0. The Suns have scored. But wait. What's this? The referee's heading over to his linesman. Surely not going to disallow it. They've given offside. Box Hill now. Attacking through Caleb Ludlow. Oh, neat there from Boccaro. Ball sends wide. Kiruki. Good save down low by Petrovsky. You see there, Petrovsky gets down well. Just bats the ball away. Box United now. In swinging corner. In it comes. Deep in the back post. Oh, great header. That's a fantastic effort there. Michael Godfrey, very unlucky. Here come the Suns. A bell for Sayer. He drives inside his left foot, hits it. Oh, just wide from the former Hume City man. Suns coming forward. Ball nodded away. Box Hill, 10 men looking to counter. Oh, mistake there for Califardis. Kiruku's through. Here he is. Hits it. 1 0. 1 0. Box Hill take the lead. A terrible mistake there from the Golden Valley Suns. And 10 men, Box Hill United, lead one goal to nil. You see there, what a fantastic strike. Leaving Petrovsky with no chance. Long hopeful ball now for Box Hill, and that's it. The referee's whistle goes. Greg Casinas, two from two as Box Hill United manager. Are they on the improve? Only time will tell. We're underway here at Kevin Bartlett Reserve. Richmond taking on Eastern Lions in this MPL1 East clash. And down the left hand side now. Cutting in now. Good opportunity for Richmond. Shot parried by Lightfoot. So the corner kick here. Whipped in to the back post. Rossi gets something on it, but not enough. And it's put away at the back post. It's Thomas Falconer, Eastern Lions, with the lead just after the half hour mark. Well, Rossi came, he didn't quite hold it. And Falconer put it away at the back post. Ball whipped into the middle. Headed down, blocked initially. Christ, a handball given! It's a penalty kick. Cahill stepping up and driving it home. Great penalty there, Tom Cahill. So now Richmond looking to get themselves in the lead here all over the top played for it again good chance cut across 
and it's Catalano who's made it 2-1. Great finish there. So now coming forward here again, good little bit of play. Now Richmond holding possession. Back forward again. Oh, lovely little flick pass. Cut back into the middle, and it's 3-1. Tom Cahill grabs his second. Fantastic bit of interplay in the build-up. And Richmond have doubled their lead here against Eastern Lions. No chance for Lightfoot. 3-1. Melbourne victory remains at the top of the MPL1 East ladder after cruising to a 9-1 defeat of Nunawadding City. Striker Joey Katabian featured with an impressive five goals while George Howard starred with three of his own. But it was Katabian who started the scoring for the visitors, neatly slotting away his second minute penalty, giving Keegan Coulter no chance. George Howard would soon double the visitors' lead as his neat strike from just outside the area was too much for Coulter to handle. Howard was again in the thick of things, this time rounding Coulter before neatly slotting the ball into the unguarded net. A neat run down the right hand side saw Howard turn provider as his ball across the face of goal was met delightfully by Lucas Derrick at the back post. But none of what he was to find himself back in the game moments later when Emil Damey found space in the area and rifled his shot past victory keeper Stephen Hatsy Curtis. But Katabian wasn't to be outdone. His header was firstly saved by Coulter before he neatly slotted the rebound in the back of the net. The victory would extend their lead after captain Joey Katabian was played in behind once again before calmly slotting the ball past Keegan Coulter. Katabian wasn't done there, scoring his fourth of the game after being played through before teasing Keegan Coulter before calmly knocking the ball in at the front post. And with just one minute to play, Katabian was to score his fifth of the game and his 20th of the season of some neat work out wide by George Howard. So the ball cut across the face and Katabian left with the easiest of tappings. Howard himself was to get a hat-trick as the ball across the face of goal was met by the young Englishman at the back post as he neatly tapped home. And a comprehensive 9-1 victory there for Melbourne Victory. The ball here in the back. Takes on one. Now chance through the middle. Off lead. On the turn, now plays it out to the right. A chance to cross here for Rangers. Ball into the middle is a good one, and it's 1 0. Great th finish there from Barakat. And the home side take the lead here against Sunshine George Cross. And the ball here, now to the left, Ptolemyo. A good switch of play. Chance here, headed back. Goalkeeper picks up the ball with ease there. And then that's a ball, and he's brought down, and a free kick. So taken quickly. Now to the left, chance to whip it into the back post. Real opportunity, and it's 2-0. Attila Offley getting his head on the ball. Guiding it back the way it came. And substitute goalkeeper, Kapunikovsky with no chance there. It's 2-0. It's a high clearance. Maybe a chance to get it back into the middle. 
Still going there, yeah, Sunshine out to the right, but poor pass there and intercepted. And now Rangers look to break. Play down the line. And a chance here. Threw on goal. Real opportunity for Winnelsee. And Offley has scored a second. A great finish there. High ball. Out to the left hand side. It's Ptolemeo who gets it down. Cuts inside. Beats a second man, then strikes. Oh, and into the top corner. It's 4 0 Whittlesey Rangers now. And this Sunshine side down to 10 men after the red card to Robert Santilli in the first half have been punished here. Chaplain Reserve is the venue here today. It's more Zebras taking on St. Albans Saints. In holding up possession here. Little turn. Now the edge of the box and the chance to strike from long range. Oh, and that's a good tip over the bar there from Konstantinovsky. There's a driving effort from the edge of the box, but a good stop from the Zebra's goalkeeper there. And coming forward here, clipped over the top. Under pressure, Kreiser offside, not given. Still going, and the strike from Yusuf! Oh, it's found its way into the back of the net. It's 1-0 more than Zebras. Well, that was something out of nothing, really. Sergio Yusuf, arms are up for offside. It wasn't given. And Yusuf, on the turn, had a strike and clipped it over Webster and into the corner. Great finish there. 1-0 more than Zebras. Yusuf running over it. It's struck. And Webster. It over the crossbar. Now St. Albans here looking for an equaliser. They find that goal to level things. The header on goal blocked. Scruffle on the line. Goalkeeper's got it in his arms. And I think referee's given a free kick there. Konstantinovsky down there. And that is full time. A massive result here for Moreland Zebras. They stay top of NPO 1 West. 1 0 the final score. And Noor now played forward. Pass back to the goalkeeper. And cleared high forward. Well, Brunswick, they've held out resolutely here. Against Pauline, but Sammy Noor, who's always dangerous. Can you keep the light? The ball whipped into the middle. Header! And it's all, it's gone straight in! Matteo Balan takes the credit. Straight from the corner kick, the ball in, captain. And well, unbelievable. So now, ball clipped over the top, heading clear. And on the turn there, cleared away out for a throw in. So now again, ball in, come forward. Played it out to the right, that's a good pass. And it could be a real chance here for a second. Under pressure, still going under the goalkeeper into the back of the net. It's 2 0 ball in Lions, and it's Dean Lorenzi with two minutes to play, putting the icing on the cake. Play through in behind. Alex Hards will be disappointed there, the goalkeeper. It's 2 0. 